In this lesson, we're going to look at understanding and interpreting histograms. We're going to look at what a histogram is and then we're going to interpret the histogram. So histogram is the graphical display of data using bars of different heights. And uh, the difference between a histogram and a, and, uh, a bar graph is, is that the histogram can put values into groups of numbers and you can put them into a specific range and uh, usually there are no gaps between the bars if you find a gap between the bars it means that that specific uh, independent variable has no value so it has a zero value let's look at some examples here so the histogram below shows the amount of rainfall during a typical raining season in paris france so we're going to use this histogram to answer a few questions what month had the highest rainfall we just look at the bar with the with the, the highest or the bar with the greatest height so that happened in august so we had the most rainfall in august what is the average amount of rain during the rainy season so let's look at that amount of rainfall here in may is 10 plus in june we had 15 in july we had 30 in august we had 45 and in september we had 25 and we have five months so 10 plus 15 is 25 so let's call this average 10 plus 15 is 25 plus 30 is 55 plus 45 is 100 plus 25 125 centimeters divided by five which is equal to 25 centimeters of rain. How many months are there in the rainy season in Paris? So we can just see from the bars, we have five months. And then what is the total amount of rain during the rainy season? We just add up, we add up the bars here. So it's going to be amount, it's going to be 10 plus 15 plus 30 plus 45 plus 25 which is going to give us 125 centimeters so that's how much rainfall we had during the rainy season for this period 